Hello, friend. How you doing? <laughs> Girl, I'm in big lots. Hold on. big lots and I'm in big lots because I came to pick up a couple things for my boyfriend as y'all know today is my baby's birthday happy birthday today I'm gonna say it till the day is done so um I just came in here to get a couple things that he's been saying he wants and needs and things that I see that he needs um y'all know how we do women when we see that the man and the kids need certain things they might not even know that they need it but we know <laughs> so I'm here picking up some of those things um and then I'm gonna head out to his one of his favorite restaurants Bonchon so I'm gonna pick him up something from Bonchon. He said that he just wants something from there. He, you know, he wants to eat from there. And he also wants something from this other place that we like to eat at. It's a hibachi place. So I am going to um, go to both places and that's what we're going to get. Y'all, I'm down to um, down the pet aisle. <laughs> trying to see if I can get Ace and Buttercup anything but they don't, they don't really need nothing they got food Ace he don't like pet beds and stuff like that so every time I get him a pet bed that's like a pillow type he tears it up he tears all of the stuff out and I just can't go through another heartache of buying a bed and he tears it up so we're not buying him any more beds. If anything, he'll get like a blanket or something. He does well with like towels, blankets, something like that in his crate. But he does not do well with pillow type of stuff. Um, and I think it's because it resembles the plush toys too much. You know, the, with the squeakies. Because he tears those to smithereens. Like he, he goes hard on those and just tears them up. I'm trying to see if they got the... Um, Febreze plug-in things, but they don't. They just have the small spaces. This, that's all they got. <clears throat> that's it. Y'all, I don't, I can't be the only person who comes in these types of stores and I have to like keep my mind, I have to stay focused because if not, girl, $500 will be spent so quick. I just can't. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I cannot. That's not why we're here. That is not why we're here. Okay, they got these. Cozy campfire. Oh, that smells good. That cozy campfire smells good. I'm going to think on it because it's $10. Let's see if they got anything else. detergent on sale. I'll probably just come back this weekend or on my birthday because I'm going to be off on my birthday too oh look at the cute little doggy costumes look y'all they so cute Oh, the little monster so cute the little hippie this will be Buttercup because she be chilling. She be chilling hard. <laughs> this is so cute. 25%. Oh, y'all, y'all know what? That actually reminds me, y'all. I got invited to a um, costume party, so I really need to be looking for a costume for me. Shit. It's in uh, about three weeks. But I forgot all about that. Oh, I might just, I don't know. I might just have to do something quick. Because I'm really not trying to spend, like, spend, spend on no Halloween costume. Because I don't really do much on Halloween for, for me to invest in a costume, for real. Like, I feel like it would be a waste of money. 
for me to spend on um, a costume. I might just do something quick, a little hat, something. I don't know. I'm going to put something together. I'll figure it out. There's always good old Pinterest and all of these other websites for ideas. Y'all, I used to be so involved in stuff like that. <laughs> I don't even be caring no more. Like, it's crazy. But I was talking to my cousin when she was doing um, Buttercup's groom <sighs> the other day when she was grooming her. And it just really made me realize how working for somebody else makes me so unmotivated. Like, oh my goodness. I hate it. Like, it ain't even like a dislike. It's like a strong hate. I don't like it at all. Mm -mm. And I think the reason is because instead of people treating you like a person on the job they treat you like they own you and it's like no we're this is an exchange and <laughs> this is a transactional exchange it's not ownership you know like I didn't sign my life away when I signed the offer letter I signed so that way we could be in business together is what it really is um but yet, you're making it seem like I'm your child or like I'm your slave. And that's not it at all. But I also think that comes with a lack of knowledge, ignorance on management part. You just get people who want a business and they just so happen to manage people because they need other people to keep that business going. And that territorial bullshit comes along you know but I don't play that over here only person that owns me is me and the good lord above so I don't I, that shit don't fly with me oh. um y'all somehow I have made my way over here to makeup <laughs> makeup and makeup brushes how did this happen oh god how did this happen i stop every time i see this type of stuff i don't know how i got over here i'm looking for something and this is not it but here we are and so we're just gonna relish in it um it's funny because everything that i'm interested in over here i actually already have for the most part in the house which is a good thing I guess because that means I'm not going to be so tempted to buy something but they got these vitamins and it actually just reminded me that I was supposed to go pick some up from by my job today oh they had these dang I got mine from CVS. Oh no, I didn't. I got mine from the um health store. Okay. Okay, so I think I'm getting closer to where I should be. Because they're gonna suck. They might not even have it in here actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, because I only saw it in a few places online. I might just have to go somewhere else and pick it up. I hope not, though. Oh, my gosh. Let me hurry up and look for this, y'all, so I can get out this store before I pick something up that I ain't supposed to. Hey, friend, I'm back. I'm getting in the car. All right, so I asked the girl that worked there if they had what I needed, and she said they didn't. So it's cool. Um... And sorry, I'm just going to have to stop somewhere else. I'm just going to have to stop somewhere else, y'all. But, now I, I did get one thing, though. And that's, the, that's actually what I went to this particular store for. So, I'm glad that they did have it because when I looked for it, it said that it was at a different location. That, like, they had it in stock at a different location, but they didn't have it in stock here. But 
this one had two in stock. I said two. <laughs> this one had two in stock. So I'm thinking they may have just restocked them today. So that was right on time. So now, um, now, 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 I gotta go find the other thing that I told y'all about. And I need to, um, go pick the food up. I think I'm gonna get him some balloons and stuff too. And some little cupcakes. He's so easy to please, so. I'm just gonna get stuff that I know he likes like neither of us had like requests for anything specific that we wanted this year I really want to see if Cole's got it hold on real quick y'all yeah all right y'all so I'm back I um went to go check Cole's to see if they had what I needed they didn't have it neither so I guess I'm just going to use Google suggestions because I've been to two stores looking for the same thing and they don't have it. But it's crazy because what I'm looking for, I used to see all the time in different stores. But I don't see it now. So, anyway. Hey, fun. So, we and Bon Chan. Thirty days food for yeah, all of our food for dinner, and, and then we're gonna head out to the next thing that I need to get, and then we're going home. I'm ready to be home. I'm ready to be home. I think I'm gonna give him his gift when he comes home from football practice. I think that's how we're gonna do it because. I still need to get his cupcakes and stuff, but I'm gonna just go and grab those kind of last minute when I go and get the other the other thing that I told y'all he wanted for um for dinner. So that's like all in the same vicinity. So I'm just gonna get that last minute. I think I'm gonna get him some cupcakes. So okay, he coming for me. Yeah. Okay, fine. So now we on the way to go and get the other gift item and um, his cake or cupcakes whatever whichever one I decide to get he's up I wanted him to be asleep when I got home <laughs> like and I should have known because he I should have known he was going to be up but for some reason I thought he might be asleep but you know what it was? I thought that I was going to have everything done way sooner. And I was just going to be off early and I was going to go straight home. But after talking to him and him letting me know like everything that he wanted and all this stuff. After we had that whole discussion last night. It created a to-do list for me today so it threw me all for my bad y'all I just feel so bomb outside I like to wrap my windows open when it feel good but it threw me off once he started saying like he wants things specific you know it threw me off because then it was like okay instead of just coming straight home now I gotta go boom 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 you know and make all these moves and I definitely knew that I wanted to get it done early because no he has football practice tonight I already know it's about to be traffic out here the kids didn't have school today um at least not where we live at so that should help ease the traffic flow just a little bit okay what are you doing but still you know I wasn't trying to just be out here all night doing stuff like I'm really trying to just get everything done so that way when he comes home from football practice with the kids then boom it's your birthday you know 
<laughs> it's the whole birthday setup and everything. So, um, I'm trying to figure out how I'm about to hide this food from him. I think when I go in the house, I'm just gonna have to like be real quick. I'm gonna leave his gift in the trunk because it's a little heavy. So I'm gonna leave it in the trunk and I'm gonna get it when I drop him off at football practice. I'll bring it upstairs then. I was gonna do his cupcakes, like bake his cupcakes and stuff on my own, but I'm gonna be blown if they don't turn out right. And I'm gonna feel bad. So I, I ain't gonna do that. y'all when I get home I guess because I got so much stuff that I still need to do and I'm trying to concentrate on the road but we got everything for the most part we just got to get these two things and then no three things and then um we're gonna go over to get the last thing when we drop them off so I'll talk to y'all later hey friend I'm back in the car friend okay I done did all the things except for one last thing that I need to do. So, that will get done after I drop my boyfriend off to the field. My bad, y'all. My nose is itching, okay? But, um, yep. So, after I drop him off, then on my way home, I'm going to make that last stop. I'm going to come home and do some stuff set everything up all of that he wanted a bottle so i got him a bottle <laughs> um he likes brown so he liked dark liquor so got him that i'm a happy girl i feel accomplished i feel like everything that i set out to do i did it um it's still early like honestly i wouldn't even be off of work right now um, if had I stayed all day, I would still be there for another like 20, what is it, uh, 3 30, no, it's 3 25. My clock is fast, so I would still be there for another 35 minutes. So, we do we doing pretty good. I'm, I'm gonna be home well before he probably expects me to, <laughs> um, so we can chill and stuff like that. And we won't really have to rush out the door to get him to football practice. Even though we typically don't have to rush out the door anyway. Because we leave in enough time. But, yeah. We typically don't have to rush out the door. I don't got stuck behind this damn metro access van. This jump off the drive. This slows in the... Oh, got one. Oh, no. Never mind. Metro access. <laughs> everybody getting from behind that don't nobody will be behind them y'all they be driving so slow metro access is basically this um it's like a system for people with disabilities and stuff like that it's like a little shuttle van type of thing but it takes them like to their appointments takes them to run errands and stuff like that but they drive so slow like i think it's part of the requirement to um be a driver like you gotta drive at a certain speed limit or something because they be driving extremely slow you be like bruh Ooh. but i mean like you know you i get it because if it's people who are elderly or mo as far as i know most elderly people don't really like you know cars driving like they don't really like that um my own grandmother like she one of my grandmothers, she, um, well, the one that's living at this point, my grandmother, she don't like to sit in the front seat if a person drives fast, it just, it makes her nervous, so I get that, you know, but it's, it is a little nerve-wracking when you're behind them and you're trying to get somewhere and they be driving all slow, but, um, y'all i'm in a good mood <laughs> god is good i'm in a good mood i am i'm excited i hope my boyfriend is happy <sighs> you know how it is when you get somebody something and you like oh my gosh 
I hope they like it. Like, I hope they see that I had them in mind when I got this for them. Like, that's how it be. So, I hope that he's happy. I hope so. And if not, I tried, you know. Got a good thumbnail. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> what you want? Bye bye. Bye bye. members which is good because it gives me enough time to go pick up the last thing that I needed to get um and everything so yeah that's what I'm doing that's I'm on my way to go pick it up and then I'm gonna go home and chill for a minute and then yeah hold on y'all okay there we go Ugh. So yeah, it's a little bit of traffic out here now, um, but it ain't too bad. So, uh, hopefully it'll die down. But actually, I don't even have to go this way home, so it's actually okay. I don't mind. <laughs> I don't mind that it's traffic right now. I don't know why I feel like I'm so close up on y'all. Like I feel extremely close up on y'all. It's, it's weird um but yeah when I get in the house I'm going to finish editing day 7 and 8 which was yesterday and the day before today's day 9 and I feel like I'm getting back on track with, with stuff because y'all I don't know what I, I think it's just a combination of real life blending in with well YouTube is real life what am I saying but like vlog life blending in with like my everyday life has just like it just and I felt it girl I was like OMG this is what it is but it's mainly because I work this stupid 9 to 5 right now so once I can get that gone I was saying once I can get this 9 to 5 situation out of my life <laughs> I'll be good well, not completely out of my life. I mean, like, you know, like, we just got to change. We got to, things need to move around. We moving around, okay? But it's chess and it's not checkers. So, you feel me? You feel me. But anyways, what you doing? Where you been? How you been? Y'all, I have energy today. I don't know what, where this energy came from. I did drink some tea earlier. My coworker, she actually gave me this tea. It's um, soursop, the fruit, with 
green tea and lemon. It's actually pretty good. It's not bad. Oops. It's pretty good. It's not bad. And y'all know, um, I'm trying to take this tea bag out of here. Y'all know green tea got caffeine in it. So I think that might be why. I don't know. But it's cool. It's giving me some sustainable, like clean energy. So I feel good. I really feel good today. Um, I don't feel groggy at all. Even when I got up this morning, I felt pretty like, like I didn't feel like tensed up or nothing like that. I just felt like chill. I was chilling. secured the final thing to make Bay's birthday great hopefully <laughs> um it has started raining and I'm a little irritated because I'm a, a little bit going to have my hands full but it's cool and I need to walk the dogs but whatever um so I'm on my way home now and I tried to get a little b-roll it wasn't much but a little bit of the restaurant because I'm trying to work on my little techniques <laughs> I'm trying to work on my little techniques and effects and stuff like that so I gave y'all a little something something what I could give y'all or whatever and uh, I'm going home so because it's raining, I'm going to concentrate on the road and see y'all when I get in the house. Hey, friend. Okay, your girl is back in the house. Um, I don't know if y'all can see, but the rain has picked up. But I'm back in the house. Um, I'm about to walk them because I know y'all hear Ace. Please come on. I'm hot. It's hot. It is hot. It is hot. Whew. But yes, y'all, I'm back in the house. Y'all, I got a bottle of champagne for tonight. Some cheap champagne. It's for me. It ain't for my boyfriend. He don't even like champagne. <laughs> but I didn't feel like drinking, like, liquor. And... I gotta work tomorrow, so I was like, I'm just gonna sip on this. 
Oh, I didn't show y'all. I got him a bottle of Douce. I was supposed to show y'all. Um, I put like little rim, like ribbons on it. You know how you take the ribbon and you just like make it curly or whatever. So I did that. It was cute. It was real cute. Damn, I wish I would have showed y'all. Damn, next time. <laughs> Maybe for Christmas or something. But y'all, I keep telling y'all, I got to get to the point where I can like vlog in the moment like i i'm so used to living in the moment that i forget to vlog in the moment and y'all that's where i mess up at so i mess up at every time because i forget to vlog and then i think about it and i'm like dang i could have vlogged that but i try to catch the most like not the most important stuff but like i try to catch the most entertaining stuff as much as I can um because y'all know like especially with vlogtober every day is not something going on it just so happens to be that we october's very young in this household you know so <laughs> so you know october is pretty decent for the most part for us um we typically have something going on normally like I've, I've said before we are on vacation in october so this is new well, kind of new. Um, because we at home at home this October, but like we've done staycation and we've gone to Ocean City and we've gone to um Reston, Virginia. Like we've done stuff locally, even if we didn't comp you know, travel out of town, out of town, you know. So this year is just us home like we home home this year so it's a little different but we're making the most of it but anyway what is this i've never had this before y'all this is a uh, wycliffe brute i'm about to pour me a glass of champagne and get a little cozy so that way when i'm walking the dogs it can go by like that because <laughs> This is probably one of my most hated chores, is walking in. Um, more specifically, the pit. Um, the little one, she cool. He trampled her last night, kind of made me mad. He, um, he gets the zoomies when we go outside, and he ran and ran over her, and it pissed me off so bad. Well, she's good. Y'all hear her walking around with her little bill. Um, he made her toenail bend. Oh, that shit looked like it hurt so bad. I put some stuff on it. We have this ointment. It's like a wound cleaner for dogs or for pet. For pet, I said for pets. For pets. So I put that on there. She's not limping or anything. So she was licking it at first because I'm sure it hurt. But she good now. You know, she's a dog too. So. That's why I said I was like a little irritated, but she's a, she's an animal, you know. She's not a baby, so. But it's just that he's so much bigger than her, so I was like scared at first because she was like she cried out. Shit scared me. I'm like, oh my god. But y'all, I gotta re up on my little um, cocktail glasses and stuff. I just got this little glass. My champagne flutes and stuff that I had broke. How they broke, I don't know, y'all. I just come home and find glass, <laughs> like little remnants of glass in certain places, and I'll be like, oh, they broke something. <laughs> That's what happens when you have males in your household, y'all. That's what happens. You just come home and your shit be broke. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. This is good. I normally like an extra dry champagne. Um, this is Brut, I think I said that before. This is a Brut champagne. So, um, it tastes a little bit more like bold is the is the description that i 
am going to use because I like I said I normally like extra dry so to me extra dry champagne is normally like sweeter it's crisp you know what I'm saying like this is like it just has more body like it's deep when <laughs> you see what I'm saying like I don't really know how to describe it besides that like that's what it gives you it's just like mm, versus you know what I'm saying? That's the that's that's the way you want to describe that. It gives you a mm instead of a ah. Um still love the bubbles though. Love the bubbles. Um but I did see a really cute when I was in Big Lots, saw a really cute um like bar, not bartender, but like a cocktail shaker, like, you know, like the cup, what is it, cocktail mixer kit, it was really cute, it was $20, it had, um, the mixer, the silver one, or like the metal one, and then it had the glass that you, and then you shake it up, it had that, it had the strainer, it just was a whole kit, it was really cute, and so I'm thinking about going and getting that for myself for my birthday, because Y'all, I got certified for everything I possibly could, okay? So, bartender school, nails, hair, girl, everything. I I just, I am just a woman of certifications and, <laughs> and skill sets. And I love it. And I would not trade it for the world. I love it. I'm a Jill. I tell people all the time, I'm a Jill of all trades and a master of whatever I choose to be, okay? So, um, yeah. Since I went to bartending school, y'all know I got my little bartending book and all my little notes and stuff like that that I took to make certain little cocktails and stuff. So, um, I don't have all the glasses, like I said, anymore. I was building up my collection of glasses, but once we got here and once we basically all started, like, just using glasses, y'all, it just was, it was a wrap. So... The next time, I didn't have a whole lot. I'm, I'm not even going to make it seem like I had a whole lot of glasses. But, like, I did have glasses for certain things. Like, I had wine glasses. Now I'm down to one. And I had, um, like, whiskey glasses or, you know, things that people would drink straight normally without, like, not like a cocktail. But, you know, like, I had those types. But it wasn't a lot of them. It was probably, like, one or two of each. I had champagne flutes, glasses for red wine, glasses for white wine. I'm going to get a bar kit eventually, and it's going, not a bar kit, but like a, what is it called? A bar, a bar cart. That's what it's called. I'm going to get a bar cart, and I'm going to have all my little glasses for my bar cart, and I think it's going to be so cute. Okay, y'all, just like that, I'm back in the house. And it is hot. Hey, friend. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Y'all, it is October 10th. And my B-Day is in two days. Ugh. Hold up. My seatbelt is trying to choke me to death. Um... Bay's B Day was a success yesterday. And now we are getting ready to celebrate fine. But um our our anniversary is actually actually today, y'all. Hey friend, I can't talk that long because I'm in um Dinner for tonight, but um, yep, and they got music playing, but it's, it's a vibe, but I know this is copyrighted, so I'm going to talk to y'all when I leave out of here.
Hey friend. Okay, so I just tried to give y'all a little bit of, I guess, B-roll. <laughs> My rendition of B-roll because y'all know I am a, I'm, 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 I'm practicing. I'm working on it. Okay, hold on. Y'all know I'm a work in progress, child. Progressing by the day, nonetheless, okay? Let's be clear. Um, but, anywho, I just left Carolina Kitchen in, um, in Hyattsville, and I just want to give a shout out, okay? First of all, her name is Kalia, okay? And this exceptional customer service, okay? Like she damn near made me feel like I was a celebrity when I when I when I called because I called in my order because I knew I we're we're eating fish tonight and so um they make it to order. So I didn't want to wait, you know. So I called in my order, amazing, over the phone. She called me like four or five times because I left, my job is like 45 minutes from where I just picked up the food. So I was on my way. She called, She told me it would be done in about 20 minutes. So I knew I was gonna be later than it was, you know, done. I knew I was gonna pick be later than when the food got done. So she's calling me, she's calling me. And y'all, I don't answer unknown numbers. So when she calling me, I'm like, who gonna keep calling after somebody just uh declined the call like who gonna do that but <laughs> then i realized i was like oh shit that's carolina kitchen they call it to let us know the food done right calling to let me know the food is done so um i called back and i let her know like i'm on my way and everything and um so then she was like oh, the girl told her or whatever so then when i got there um kalia she rang me up and everything like that but sis has like her customer service is impeccable like girl i don't know if that's her only job but she needs a raise she need a raise she needs some type of recognition so carolina kitchen in hyattsville by pg plaza if somebody from there is watching this and you are a management Kalia needs a raise, okay? Um, but yes, I want to. I just want to say thank you to her for her amazing customer service, and I am on my way to go. I need some. Like, I feel like I need some electrolytes or something. Like, I'm thirsty. <laughs> like, I'm dehydrated, thirsty. But I think it's because. I drank this Celsius today, and y'all, I didn't drink a lot of it because the caffeine content in this thing is out of this world. 200 milligrams, like, that's a lot. So, <coughs> I only drank a little bit of it. I didn't even drink half the can. So, I'm not going to finish that today. That will probably be drank throughout the week until Friday. Um... Excuse me, but I do need to hydrate because I feel dehydrated since drinking that. So I'm on my way to um, get something to drink. And actually, I'm sorry, y'all. Um, I'm on my way to go pick up some crab legs and I guess something to hydrate with. You know what? I probably will just stop at 7-Eleven for something to hydrate with because I just don't feel like going all through the grocery store just to get, like, no Gatorade or nothing that I could have just picked up from a convenience store. I already did my grocery shopping for the week. I'm mad I got to go in here and get these crab legs. <laughs> but this is another request that they had for his birthday. So, we going to... Um, eat this food when we get when I get in the house and watch the BET awards I think um 
if the BET Awards got too much going on, I ain't even gonna hold y'all. I probably won't watch the whole thing, but I'm gonna watch. I'm gonna tune in um, just to see what's up with it. But they be doing a lot, and sometimes I just I don't know. Like it just be weird vibes, and I just don't. I just don't want to partake sometimes with that. So we gonna see. But I just want to. Yes, shout out Kalia at uh carolina kitchen i wasn't even gonna get on camera because i feel like i'm always in the car when i'm on camera and so i was like yeah i ain't about to get in the car i mean i ain't about to get on the camera i'm just going you know go run my little errands and i was going to get on the camera when i got home but i said why not she deserves a shout out and she deserves it while i'm feeling the high that she gave me from her exceptional customer service so okay y'all i'll talk to y'all when i get home Okay, y'all, so first of all, this is my first time trying this. It's the Lemon Perfect Hydrating Lemon Water, zero sugar. This is the pineapple coconut flavor. It's so good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. I'm probably late, but I don't even care. I'm so happy I found this. Because <laughs> I told y'all I felt like dehydrated. So, this was, this is really good. Yeah, it's really good. Um, But anyway, y'all. So, I went into the giant got some crab legs so now i'm about to go get some roll-ups and then i'm going to the house so i'll talk to y'all when i get home y'all i am home and i feel so good um yeah i feel a whole lot better i feel a whole lot better i don't know what it is about work clothes but girl you ready to strip at the front door okay this is amazing this is amazing I'm about to keep these on deck because I feel hydrated which is good very good Whew. I was thirsty yes ma'am Lemon perfect. It's perfect. Hey, big boy. What's up, my nigga? Huh? Nigga, what's up? Hmm? What's up, nigga? What the time for? Hmm? What the time for? Hmm? You miss mommy, dad? You miss your mommy? Hmm? Hmm? You miss me, dad? I love you. I love you. I need some of my food when I'm eating, okay? Or after I eat. Okay? Okay? I'll stay you a little bit. Alright? If only you would just call me out the cage. That would be beautiful.